everybody, this is Alex from Mental Culture Medicine. So I have some requests of people who are uh, friends with me on Facebook and uh, who also practice the Lenormand card uh, readings. And they ask me how would I use the Lenormand to give uh, a weekly reading. Knowing that I do a uh, monthly forecast for all 12 signs, astro 12 signs, so they wanted to know if it is it is possible to uh, give a weekly reading using the Lenormand Oracle. So with Lenormand, it is limitless. You can do whatever you want. You just need to tell the cards what you want them to do for you, okay? And in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how you can give a, a practical, but also a spiritual weekly reading using the Lenormand Oracle. So for this uh, video, I'm going to use my classic Lenormand for this reading. And I'm going to shuffle my cards and I'm going to tell the cards what I want. So I would like to receive a message for this new week. What everyone needs to know and what area actually we need to focus on, okay? So I'm just going to find the cards and then pick three cards. One, two, and three, okay? So we are going to look at the cards individually, but also uh, all together, like, you know, it's like a choir. They all song, sing in harmony. So the third card is the tree, okay? So the tree is a card of health, of well-being, of feeling grounded. And the advice of this card for this week is really to ground yourself for meditation, okay? So if you um, have pre-ordered my book, The Art of the Normal Reading, here, there is a, a section in the card meaning where uh, I give, you know, a message, spiritual message that the, the cards convey. And here it is, ground yourself for meditation because there is a lot going on and maybe you're feeling tired, you're feeling disconnected. And this is also on the heel of this week or card reading where we was speaking about grounding, so you can check that as well. So three, ground yourself for meditation and, uh, you know, Pose yourself where you are. If you're expecting something to happen, know that it will take time as the tree in timing is about, you know, taking time to grow, okay? And the tree is strong, the tree stand still, you know? So maybe you will need to uh, actually be patient this week because what you're looking for will happen as quick, okay? So the second card is the whip. The whip is about argument and uh, discussion. And the spiritual message of this card is choose peacefulness, okay? Choose, ground yourself first and choose to be peaceful. Because when you're peaceful, you are more able to see things in different uh, perspective and also adopt another strategy or attitude, okay? So don't be um, spontaneous with things this week. Take your time as the tree is telling you, take your time, sit down, okay, and, you know, put things in order and do it peacefully, okay? So the last card is the roads. The roads, spiritual message is choose now, okay? So before taking any decision, you need to ground yourself, choose peacefulness, and then you can decide. Because if you're not following the thread of this prediction, your week may be you know, a little bit difficult to deal with because you will act um, on impulsion, you know, impulsively, and you will not listen to your higher guidance, okay? So this is how I give a weekly reading using the Lodomo Oracle card. It is very quick, as you can see, rich in interpretation and also down to earth, okay? So what you can do as well, if you have a specific, let's say, a meeting or event during the week, okay? You would shuffle your cards and let's say uh, uh, next week there is, uh, I'm supposed to uh, actually, you know, uh, deliver a baby, okay? So I would like to know what the message of the week will be regarding this situation. Three will be 
breathe, relax, meditate, choose to be peaceful instead of falling into drama. And this is the best choice for you. Okay, you see how the card can actually reply to various uh, various uh, question, and the con it changes depending on the context. So you can do an open uh, ended uh, reading like, what is this week going to bring me? You pull three cards. Okay, why I pull three cards because uh, the minimum card for your normal reading is two. And you know the the third card add an, another extra, but then you can do a five card, you can do seven card reading. I explain all that in my book. How you can, uh, you know, uh, start with two card reading, then to three, to five, to seven, to nine, to thirteen, and to uh, fifteen, and then to the card tableau. Okay, so you don't need to do the card tableau for a week because the card tableau cover is like you know. A long term prediction, you know, when I do it, it's for three months or six months. So, for a shorter amount of time, choose you know, small spread, very simple, very effective, you know, and very to the point, actually. So, I send you love, light, and blessing.